the first place you should explore is TiVo Central. To get here, just push the TiVo button on your remote and you'll find all that you need to get started. TiVo Central gives you an overview of everything Premiere can do. Think of it as your home base. Up top, you'll find My Shows, which contains everything your DVR has recorded for you. It's like your personal library of great stuff to watch. Here's a TiVo tip. You can get to My Shows at any time by double-clicking on the TiVo button. Find TV, movies, and videos is exactly what it sounds like. It's also where you can get movies and shows from the web. Here's where you manage your recordings. You can see your upcoming recordings and prioritize and modify your season pass recordings. Take a few minutes and navigate around on TiVo Central. When you go to most menus while watching a program, you'll see a live TV window in the upper right-hand corner, showing the movie or TV show that's currently playing. Want to pause the action? Just hit pause. And when you're ready to continue, just press it again. See? It's easy. If you want to return to the recorded show you were watching, just hit the zoom button. If you want to jump to what's playing on live TV right now, just hit the live TV button. One thing TiVo is famous for is the ability to get what you want when you want it. Just click here to fast forward. Hit it again and you'll zoom along. One more time and you're really flying. This button jumps you ahead 30 seconds, which is really nice. How about rewinding? If you miss the last second touchdown, hit this button to rewind 8 seconds and see it again. Now you can hit play or slow for slow motion. I should take a moment to mention two buttons you'll definitely want to know about. The guide button gives a simple look at your available channels and what's playing on each, as well as what's coming up. It's the quickest way to see what's on and makes recording a cinch. Above that is the info button, which will give you a quick rundown about the show you're watching.